Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Maddles and today I've got game number one of a best of three and I forgot to put the nice little best of three things up on the overlay but it's fine because I've done it now. It's going to be some TVT today and it is going to be an exceptionally good game from actually a Chinese tournament so really excited to see which way this is going to go but up in the top right position spawning as the teal Terran it is Infi. And his opponent in the bottom left, you're going to have to take my word for it, but I guarantee you that this is the Red Terran player, Marine King Prime. So a super high quality TVT coming up here. Um, really excited to see what's going to be going on. Um, the map, of course, is Derelict Watcher, quite a large map. And, ooh, Supply Depot coming in the back, and SCV getting pulled. Marine King, what have you got planned here? This is going to be something fun coming down right now, because, of course... If there was a Supply Depot at the front there, and this SCV wasn't pulled, I wouldn't be too worried, but oh no. Infi, he's going for a gas first. Marine King, what have you got planned? This this is likely to be proxied. Oh, there comes the second one. It's a proxy. 11-11, two racks coming down, and Infi has no idea. Going gas first, going to be going up into the barracks straight after this, then attempting to get out a super fast factory too. Up against an 11-11, two racks. This is ridiculously hard to hold, and game one is going to be on a knife edge. It's going to be quick either way. Is Infi going to be able to hold this off? Well, for the moment, Marine King, he's just coming down. The SCVs creeping their way forward. Going to be chucking down a couple, a second barracks now, any second. Here we go. There's the second barracks. Meanwhile, Marine King just sitting back at home, happily mining up those minerals. In feature, still there. The barracks is getting made, but it's so, so late. The first barracks, of course, is already half done there for Marine King Prime. He's getting up the second one as well. The double marine production going to start shortly. And look, it's just really not very far away. All he's got to do is come down here. Run up the ramp, which isn't walled off either, and suddenly Infi could be in a lot of problems. The factory, of course, is going to start as soon as this barracks is done, and that should be before the first marine makes it over. So Infi is going to have no indicator that he shouldn't be doing that and needs to get down a bunker. So as soon as this barracks finishes, there's the gas already for Infi to start up that factory. Back at home, SCV's getting pulled here for Marine King Prime 2. The SCV making his way up, coming to scout. There's the factory going down. Infi's going to see this SCV and may not think anything too scary of it. He's just like, well, it's scouting. That's fine. One Marine coming out, but of course, one Marine already there. The SCV pool is coming down. Trying to run away. This SCV just being quite aggressive about trying to stay in position, which may act as a little bit of a warning sign to Infi. And there we go. Scouting down here, just making sure there isn't anything. And of course, now sees the second SCV. Sees the Marine, and the bunker is coming down. The SCV, though, is being forced back by Infi at the moment, so Marine King Prime is going to have to get some really nice control. In come the SCVs as well, and this is where everything gets very, very intense. Marines are fighting it out as bitter sweetly as they can. The Marine count is slightly in favour of Marine King Prime, but not by a huge amount. 5-2, to two, but SCV numbers are in favour of Infi. Still, Marine King with the incredible stutter step. Micro wants to make sure these Marines stay up as long as possible. As many SCVs as possible are taken down. We do, of course, have a Hellion coming out as well for Infi, but currently Marine King Prime is really looking to put on the paint. He's behind in workers. He's got to make this work. He's got to win the game now. Otherwise, it is all over for him. The Marines getting focused down quickly out comes the Hellion. The bunker completes and that is a critical spot because now the Hellion isn't even that threatening. The SCVs repairing up the bunker. Now, of course, Marine King Prime ahead. 7-4 to four SCVs and things looking very good for him right now. So, the Red, Zerg, the Red Terran player, rather, is now sitting in a position where bunkered up. Infi has got to find a way to break this. We've got another Hellion coming out. More Marines trying to come out, but now in comes Marine King. He's moving his way forward. He is just going to go for it. Picking off these SCVs, picking off the Marines. 2-1-0 workers now for Infi. Admittedly, only five there for Marine King Prime, but that should be now GG because even this hero Hellion, I don't think, is going to be able to save the day. Not even the help with his pal, the Marine. And this just means the Marine King, as he takes it out, the GG is probably going to come down after this. And there we go. Game number one, very quick, goes to Marine King Prime. So, flick over to my channel, and I'll see you at game number two in just a second.